Hey everybody, Rick Eden handicapping thoroughbred racing on Thursday afternoon, March the 15th. This is my Equibase Winter Circle East Coast racing report. Let's go to the Big A Aqueduct first for race 8. 3.46 p.m. Eastern Post Time, 8.3 furlongs. That's a mile and 70 yards. On Aqueduct's winterized inner dirt track, fillies and mares, three years old and up, racing for an optional claiming prize of some $59,000. Contenders number two, Alphabet Jamerica. Number seven, Ginger Snap It. Number four, Quicksand. And number three, Freud's Notebook. Number two, Alphabet Jamerica is both the overall speed and pace profile leader in this optional claiming field this afternoon. Has hit the board in power run fashion each of her four career starts to date, including back-to-back -back power run wins in her first two starts. Number seven, Ginger Snappet has hit the board in power run fashion in two of her last three adventures, including a power run win her last time out. Jockey Eddie Castro was in her irons for that win 32 days ago here at the Big A which produced a positive 520% return on investment in the process. It's back today for a second ride, gunning for back-to-back -back circle trips. Race 8 summary number 2, Alphabet Jamerica, tops my contenders list today, which also includes number 7, Ginger Snap It, number 4, Quicksand, and number 3, Freud's Notebook, 2743 in the 8th from the Big A. Gulfstream Park, race 6, 3.35 p.m. Eastern Post Time. Five furlong sprint on the turf track. Phillies and mares, four years old and up. Race for an optional claiming prize of some $62,750. Contenders number two, Air Guitar. Number seven, Magic Mesa. Number six, She's Packing Heat. And number eight, Mint Martini. Number two, Air Guitar, a four to one shot. Has hit the board in power run fashion in two of her three career starts to date, including a power run win to break her maiden in her last start. Jockey Paco Lopez was in her irons for that win, is back today for his second ride, gunning for back-to-back -back circle trips. Number 7, Magic Mesa, takes a class drop of 8 units, shares the speed honors in this field, sprinting at her about today's distance of 5 furlongs on the dirt. With number 6, she's packing heat, has hit the board in both of her last two starts, including her respective maiden breaker in her second race back. Race 6 summary number 2, Air Guitar, tops the contenders list today here at Gulfstream Park, which also includes number 7, Magic Mesa, number 6, She's Packing Heat, and number 8, Mint Martini, 2768 in the 6th today from Gulfstream Park. Bonus long shots, Penn National Race Course, race 4, the 4 to 1 shot, number 1A, Angel, the overall speed leader in his claiming field, racing at the mile. Racing at the distance of a mile and 70 yards on the dirt. Charlestown, race 8, the 4 to 1 shot. Number 8, Shine for Me. Qualifies as a Trackmaster Plus Power Pony. Takes a 14 level class drop tonight as the speed leader in this allowance field. Sprinting at or about tonight's distance of 4 and 1 half furlongs on the dirt. So, handicapping from both the Big A, Aqueduct, and Gulfstream Park on a Thursday, Rick Needham for the Equibase Winter Circle. Reminding you, as always, to please bet with your head. Not over it.